welcome back to my channel. I am doing a, another edition of my Dollarama Life series and I had made some purchases at Dollarama recently uh, with uh, kitchen things in mind that I needed. Uh, so when I first moved into this apartment I bought a number of n new items which it's almost two years ago now um, at Target. Uh, one of them was a cutlery, um, but it's got plastic bottom and it's starting to look janky. So when I was at Dollarama, I decided to pick up four of these sets. And that way they're $4 a piece, so that was a total of $16. Um, something that I wanted all summer. Uh, that I've seen at a friend's place that they got from Dollarama uh, was this picture and it is in my favorite color, one of my favorite colors. So I picked this up and then I also saw these little mason jar mugs that also have that cute top on it. Uh, so I picked some of them up and then I picked up a little bit of home decor as well too, uh, photo clip lights as well as this uh, little home decor thing uh, that you basically make little letter things on. Uh, this was $4, this was $4 as well. Um, I have seen Twinkle Lights, um, stuff like this cost like 20 bucks at Pier 1. And I've seen exactly the same at Pier 1 and other places where these cost at least, I think, $10. So four bucks is a good buy on that, something that's a little quiche, but uh, I like it. Um, and I did get some more kitchen accessories. Um, I did get a can opener, the kind with this, because the one I have isn't that great. Um, and then I thought I had metal tongs, but I did not. So I picked up one. I like using them when I'm mixing up salads. And then I got a funnel. And this funnel is great for space saving. Um, I do live in a small apartment, uh, so I'm always thinking about how can I save space. So this funnel holds up and it was only, I believe it was two bucks as well too. And then um, something cool I picked up was a roasting thermometer. And I picked this up because um, when my brother and my mom were over, we made steak. Um, I don't have access to a barbecue, so I need to do steak on my stove top. And um, we were unsure of the internal temperature of the steak uh, to get it to its best medium rare. My brother did do an excellent job. One was, one of the steaks was a little on the rare side, uh, but it was still good. Um, and it was actually, uh, actually I think both my brother and my mother's steak were a little on the rarer side for a portion of it, but they didn't eat all of their steaks. They actually ended up leaving that rarer selection for me, and I had it later as a meal. But yes, I picked up one of these so I could get my steak to a perfect medium rare. Um, and then uh, lastly um, are some little cleaning uh, things. So uh, Arm & Hammer uh, for my fridge. I need a new one of those. Uh, Febreze, uh, just freshen up uh, the place a little bit. It's not really Febreze, I think it's Jazz or whatever, the uh, Dollarama brand. It's only $1.50. Um, and keeping in line with having things smell good. Um, stick ups, I'm actually going to put one of these on top of Mikey's litter bin because uh, I'm always paranoid um, if somebody's over that they can smell his litter. I do clean his litter often, but I mean, if he's just gone, you can smell it. <laughs> then the Mega Valley can for my bathroom, you know, for keeping it fresh in the bathroom. All right, guys, thank you so much for tuning into my episode of Dollarama Life, the household kitchen edition. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please do and click the notification bell to get email reminders when I'm uploading videos. And lastly, guys, always remember life's a journey, not a destination. So buckle up and enjoy the ride.